and welcome to another PA Pages how-to tutorial video. In this video, I am going to show you a neat little trick on how to lock only certain parts of a Microsoft Word document. Now, as a virtual EA, part of my role with clients is to review and revise their monthly blog posts. As part of this job, I also have to upload the blogs into their websites. So as you know, different blog posts have different categories. So what I do is I grab that list of categories from their website and I create a little checkbox list. So in order for them to be able to tick and select which boxes they want to use, I actually have to block that certain part to, meet, to create a form. And anything else underneath that, they can edit and I can edit. So in order to do that, what you need to do, and this is the most important part of this exercise, is to create and insert a section break. So to do that, you just go up the top here to insert, click on break, and you wanna make a section break, but you want it to be continuous. You can go to next page and that'll split the two pages in half. In this case, I like to just keep it as continuous. So once you've done that, it puts an invisible section break in the document. Then what you need to do is click on protect document in your review tab up here. Then under protection, you need to click on forms. And in the sections here, you only want to select section one. So to see if you wanted to see the difference in the sections, anything above the section break that you put, would be section one and anything below would be section two. So in this case, I only want this section one to be blocked. So I click on OK. Once you've done that, click on OK again. Now, as you can see, everything up the top here can be selected as a form and anything under here can be typed in. So there you go, there's a great little tip to be able to work with your executive or your manager and create some forms and get some nice processes happening within the business. If you have any questions, please feel free to comment below or send an email to hello at papages.com.au. In the meantime, don't forget to subscribe. I'll see you next time. Bye for now.